All right, what's going on, everybody? Welcome to the channel. My name is Big Fry, and if you guys are new here, we cover a plethora of games from early access, multiplayer, FPS, third person shooter, and everything in between. Yesterday's video uh, was a video in response to a video that I released the day before, in which I uh, I was asking for some likes. If we hit certain like goals, the, the 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 next video comes out, and here we are again. I said 3.2k, and uh, y'all are crushing it right now. The numbers are just insane. Uh, so I appreciate you guys watching, clicking on the video today. Oh boy, do we have a good one today. A game hit my desk the other day in this flurry of games that people sent to me to cover. This one came out in June, and usually I don't like covering games that I may have missed or games that are a little bit older because chances are you guys don't really care about it and I mean really at the end of the day I feel like you guys don't give a shit about any of these games that I cover in the early access realm uh we just do it for fun but the game was called Tommy's Battleground I'm gonna throw up some screenshots here a picture of the uh the Steam page and you guys can probably tell probably trash no user reviews doesn't look like anybody's getting scammed on this one which is is good people are starting to to read into it a little bit starting to look at the bullshit but it's funny when i scroll down i see our game will come out of early reach i don't know if they misspelled access or whatever in november of 2020 our game will be out of reach early when it, I, 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 I don't know what the word reach is. I found it funny that uh, they said that it was coming out in November. It's apparently like a, a, a Battlegrounds, Tommy's Battlegrounds, FPS survival game, but it's only single player. According to Steam, it's tagged as massive multiplayer, but uh, but it's only, it's only a single player game, which I, f I find a little strange. And then I noticed that they're selling a bundle with two games, Tommy's Battlegrounds and Mafia Gangster City for 65% off, which a little bit strange, that's, that's weird. So they obviously have another game that came out before uh, this Tommy's Battlegrounds did. But then when you, when you click on Mafia Gangster City, it takes you to this mobile looking, you know, flash game from 2007. And I noticed that it's not in early access, but it came out July 31st, 2020. So it came out after Battlegrounds. And I was like, well, well, that's a little weird. You already have a game in early access. Doesn't look like it was successful because it's a single player battle royale. Okay. Uh, and now we have this. I don't think that's right. So let me go click on their developer page and let's have a look and wouldn't you know it, another game has released this year from them called Horroron, uh, Horroromicon, Horroromicon, uh, ho har uh, it came out November 6th, 2020 and guys, you've been supporting the channel so much lately that I decided to check out all three of them in one video. I don't know what the title of this video is going to be at the time of recording, but just know this is a Webby Lemus Web Web Weblams special. Three early access videos for the for the price of one, which is also free. But it doesn't have to be free. If you guys want to support the channel directly, 99 cents a month, become a member, hit the join button down below. We're going to start with Tommy's Battlegrounds. So, let's jump into it. <laughs> All right. Fuck me. All right. Telltale signs, ladies and gentlemen. The road's just ending. I'm starting to see a recurring pattern. And to be honest with you, I've been seeing that same pattern for... For years now. Um, So this is a single player... Is it a survival game? Like, there's hunger and thirst. That's a branch. I'll pick that up, I guess. What's this? Uh, 12. Okay. Uh... Uh, so, like, is it, is it a survival? The fuck is that? Is there a... What, what is this? Oh, okay. That's awkward. That's a random, uh... Oh, what the fuck are those? <laughs> what the hell is this? Wait! What? 
What the fuck? Oh! Oh, ow! Oh, I went through the car, I guess. Okay. Okay, they all just spawn there, and I don't have a weapon. Can I open this door? No, probably an art asset, right? Uh, yeah, probably. Um, is this like the only city? I'll run this way and see what happens. The moon is fucking gigantic, bro. I feel like there'd be tsunamis. Okay, so that looks to be like the only city. You know, we, we say baby's first project, right, type shit, but like, this is obviously just a scam, right? This is like, this is the definition of Steam's early access platform. Literally, a fucking wasteland. Every screenshot on the Steam page is from that city back there. So, I'm gonna venture to say that they built that city strictly for the screenshots. Y'all, y'all know we gotta do it. You know we have to find the edge of the level. This game has all the telltale signs. No multiplayer servers. Road assets that just stop. Levels that go on forever. It's kind of hard on the eyes to like look at the ground. You gotta like look straight up. This is a way better experience than that. So a single player battlegrounds experience with five buildings. And 4,000 miles of land. If a dev really wanted to troll me, they would make it so the world kind of just goes on forever, like procedurally generate terrain forever and ever. After 20 minutes, they think I give up. I don't give up. I will find the edge of the map. It's just, it's what we do here. Like, they, they make it so long, nobody's going to try to find the edge of the map by this point, because there's nothing here. <laughs> you, you, know, you know what you find at the edge of maps like this? Content. Tommy's Battlegrounds, ladies and gentlemen. Holy, look at those fucking clown shoes. Why do- we, look at his feet. Look at the bot. I would love to see this in third person. I think I'm at the edge of the map, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. Oh, there we go. Okay, I am in oblivion now. It's just me and the moon now. So, I mean, I guess it's a decent wallpaper if you like, you know, grayscale moons. Uh, I don't- I don't want to register. Hold on, let me see if I can just do this. Don't have character create now. Uh, trash devs. Welcome to game. Train Frist. Go store and buy some equipment with your money. Then do story. You can commit a crime which level is equals to or more than story level. Got it. Uh, weapon no. Well, weapon zero. Weapon one. Weapon two. Let's, uh, let's get weapon t uh, two. Wait, how much money do I have? 2,500. Okay, buy weapon one. Inventory. Okay, let's go to story. Story. Let's do story. Enemy information. Too easy. Attack. Info. Need to equip your items. What the fuck is this? Equip. Info. Can't equip. Why? What is... Requirements 50-50. I don't know what that means. Can't equip. That means I have to go to the shop and I have to buy weapon zero. Now I have to go to my inventory. Hey, equip weapon zero. Okay, now go to the story. Do story. Information too easy. Attack. Need to equip your items. I thought I did that already. What else do I need to buy? Do I need to buy ammo? Let's try and get a fucking helmetto. Let's try to get a chesto. Let's try to get some fucking handzo, bro. Let's, can I scroll down? Scroll down does not work. Go to the inventory. Let's equip. Fucking equip. Equip your hands out, bro. Story, do story, attack. You need to train, okay? How do I train? Let's go to train. Let's train intelligence. Training. Let's train strength. Intelligence. Train. 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 Uh, okay, story. Now go. Here, attack. Too easy. Doing story. Do story. Succeed. Win. This is a good game. Do story. Do story. Succeed. Win. Do story. Attack. Okay, story two. Enemy win. Don't care. Gonna do it again. Okay, don't care. Do it again. Okay, don't care. Do it again. Your health is not enough. Your health is not enough. Okay, now let's go to the story. Can I do something with my health? Your health is not enough. So now I have to wait. <sighs> um, all right, it's time to check out uh, Hurricane Rana. I, I don't know where my mouse is. I have to use the arrow keys to select. This is great. Play a new game. Let's find out. Press any key. Apparently the space bar doesn't count. Do I have to play on a controller? 
No. Oh, that actually worked. Oh. So I have to use a controller, I guess. Uh, okay. Oh god, the sensitivity though, huh? What the fuck? Alright, use. You just- you just came from Oustide! Well, I wanna go back Oustide. Blood splatter, uh, off of, uh, Google. Alright, let's see, we got a gun. Let me take it. You have found a Glock 18, so I can shoot. How do I use it? There we go. There we go. Glock 18. Got it. Uh... Oh my god. The lines are dead. Can I pause? Okay, so I can't change any sensitivity options. What's that smell? It smells like fucking trash games on Steam again. Sensitivity is just fucked. Okay. Oh, what is that there? Is that a little tree? How do I grab it? Fuck me. Bro, the sensitivity is broken. Oh, hey! I'm just gonna, just gonna close that. Is that, is that, I just gotta fight him? Oh, I can't actually move my character anymore. Oh, yeah, my joystick's broken. I think the crouch actually broke me. Oh, through the door he goes! Okay. I can't move. Main menu. Holy fuck. Let me grab the Glock, sure. Uh, gonna use it like this. It's gonna go very scary. Oh, oh, what's going on? I saw him run over there. Cool. Let's jump over here. Oh, what was that? Switch the electricity back on. Okay, let's open this up. Guy just spawns in right off the bat. Love it. Uh, where? Wow, this is really hard to aim. Okay. So don't crouch ever. Uh, just a random long room with one fucking sconce in it. Okay, great. More more Adobe Photoshop brushes. Uh, okay, this game is terrible. But I'm pretty sure this is the same Glock from Tommy's Battlegrounds screenshots. So that's cute. At least they're, you know, recycling. I don't know if you guys can even see what's going on because I fucking can't. Door is locked. I need to find a key. That door is locked. So is there a place to get a key? A petrol bottle? Okay. Did he drop a key? Oh. Bro, I can't see shit, man. What about this? See, there's a thing there. But I know last time I tried to grab it, it glitched. Picked up the herb. Okay, got it. What about the bottom drawer? Nothing? God. That's a lantern. Uh, okay. Oh, here we go. We got some fucking light. So. Oh, see, I didn't even see that door. Oh, the door is locked. Find another path. This is feeling very, uh... What the hell? What's radiating light if there's no electricity? There's just a light there. Okay. Is there something to grab in here, dude? I don't I don't know what it wants me to fucking do, bro. I need to find a key. There's got to be a key in this. Or maybe there's a key here. There's just a dead... A, just a head sitting on the... I don't know. No key, no key, no key. Okay. Uh, is there any key sitting on top of here? What is that? Examine. Uh, the right trigger does not rotate it. Okay. Okay, put away. Take the banana. Take the apple. I can't see anything. Is there a key here? What about that? Electricity's powered off, great. And you can't walk that way. I don't give a flying fuck about any of this. Why early access? Because, oh, here we go. There are shortcomings in our game, and we want to improve that with the community. Our game is now on the open beta, so we decided to have early access. It has its shortcomings now, and we will complete them. We will add new maps, new scenarios. We will add new objects. And our goal is to give a good gaming experience, much more scenarios. In our game, we are in a house now, and a psychopath scares us. We have to find the keys and get rid of them. 
More options, sections, will be added to our game in the future. Our current goal, include adding new levels to our game, more advanced jump scars, and multiple enemies. They're estimating it comes out of early access mid-2021. Estimated at, that could take some time. The price of the game will increase when the game comes out of an early access. I, uh, I don't, I don't think... Oh, this is cute. Check this shit. All right, let's look at the updates. So the game released, uh, when? The game released November 6th. They dropped episode 2 on November 7th. And they dropped episode 3 on November 8th. So they are cranking out the content. Uh, honestly... Listen, I'm not even going to tell you guys not to buy it because I know you guys are smarter than that. Nobody's buying this trash, okay? Three user reviews. Oh, great game. A few jump scares, few glitches. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, Ruby Steps the Developer. Oh, that's interesting. Bin Burr Oyen. Let's read his review. I would recommend this game. Very nice, scary graphics. Good control, simple. Yeah, yeah. Let's have a look at his profile here. It's funny. Plus rep right here from, oh, somebody named Ruby Step. Seems like they're friends. Seems like the reviews are being manipulated. Listen, man, if you guys enjoy the videos, please leave a like on them. Consider subscribing if you haven't done so already. If you guys want to support the channel, you can literally go to my merch page. You can go to my game store, nexus.gg slash bigfry. You guys can check out a whole bunch of things. You can get great deals on literally legit games. No gray market shit. You guys can support the channel directly through, you know, becoming a member. Click the join button. But as always, I just appreciate you guys watching. So thank you for everything. My name is Big Fry, and I'll see you on the next one.